Halloween night, 1963, in Haddonfield, Illinois, there would be a gruesome case of sibling rivalry between kids in the Myers family. When Michael, a six-year-old, leisurely walked into his sister's room silently and butchered her body so violently, he left for a mental facility. And when the state hospital deputy relaxed the maximum security, then Michael would stop waiting patiently for another chance at a murder spree. His doctor, Sam Loomis, tried legally to put him away for Eternity. Said my patient has no humanity But others did not exactly agree They said Michael was the epitome Of the ideal patient's activity No crying, no talking, no moving He would just sit and stare absentmindedly Yet 15 years later he wandered free By breaking out from his captivity Now all he had left to do was to flee Back to his old peaceful community Where his house was sold by Strode Realty Whose daughter became inevitably The subject of all his hostility A true Michael Myers authority Who has the uncanny proclivity To suffer no serious injury While friends who are in her vicinity Without they'll become a casualty They fall victim to his insanity They're strangled and mangled creatively They're grabbed and then stabbed hard repeatedly They're decapitated so easily You think you get bored from monotony, he kills each one individually, employing equal opportunity, it's quality versus more quantity, he'd relive a childhood memory, to the best of his own ability, but there would not be much difficulty, since he seems to have no mortality, or reason, or conscience entirely, devoid of any personality, his sense of life and death and good evil seemed extremely rudimentary. The boogeyman's responsibility is to maintain the notoriety of death as an impossibility or fade slowly into obscurity. But you are one miracle prodigy. You've given this killer the third degree. You vanquished the evil amazingly. Ignored all your father's some OCD. You check up on his heart accordingly. So while he is lying there lifelessly while you are still breathing so heavily you sit there and thank God that finally it's over, it's done with them luckily You planned each potential contingency You blinded his eyes temporarily You drove that knife through his chest cavity You shot him in every extremity You forced him right off of the balcony There's no way in hell that he'd possibly Get up and walk right off your property That stuff only happens on the TV So you'll be safe in police custody They'll quickly make a positive ID Of Michael's cold twisted anatomy You'll garner the neighborhood sympathy And after a good deal of therapy You'll be back in touch with reality And understand why philosophically The apple does not fall far from the tree When creating our own worst enemy